When you go to youtube.com, are you seeing videos recommended that maybe aren't the videos that you want to see there? Uh, for me, uh, when I'm doing a presentation or something, I go to my YouTube page, uh, usually recommended are a bunch of maybe inappropriate looking thumbnails for videos. It's because of the music that I listen to. I listen to EDM music and many of the thumbnails feature bikini clad women and um, because I'm listening to this music for hours at a time, YouTube thinks that I really, really like it. So I'm gonna show you how to clean that up so that you'll get something different recommended to you on your homepage. Let's say I wanna get rid of the bikini clad women on this page. So as I mentioned, YouTube recommends the videos that they think that you're gonna watch. So the things that you spend the most time watching is what they'll recommend to you most often. What I'll do is I'll go over to YouTube here I'll go click on the three lines and go down to history. So what you're going to do is you're going to modify your history uh, so that the stuff that you don't want to show up as recommended isn't part of your history anymore. So let me go remove this one. And you can see it's, it's not that common in my history. It's just that I let it run for hours at a time. So YouTube thinks that I really like it, which is true. Taylor Swift too, that might be a little bit You guys are getting a good look at what my viewing habits are. Okay, well let's see if that made the change. I've gone back a little ways here. So now let me go back to click on YouTube to show my homepage. And you can see how things have changed now. So I'm still getting some music, um, but not nearly as many bikini clad ones because uh, they're coming from slightly different stations that I've listened to in the past. A uh, number of things still the same, but essentially just going in, cleaning out your history is what's going to change what shows up as recommended on your homepage. So often if I'm doing a presentation, I'll go in and do this beforehand to clean it up, or if I accidentally go over and I'm using a client's channel, uh, I'm logged into a client's channel when I start listening to music or something, all of a sudden on their channel, they're starting to see those recommendations. So this is just an easy way to clean that up. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video and subscribe if you'd like to hear more.